Hi everyone, happy Saturday. Now I'm just, um, just apologies in advance because you're going to hear a live game in the background of um, Fortnite. They're all playing together online. But they know and they've been told to mind their P's and Q's. All right, so I hope you can join me. Hello, Helena. So I thought I'd do a live get ready with me and do another look using this palette. And people were saying that they liked my complexion yesterday. So I thought I would... Hello, Linda. I thought I would recreate that. So I'm putting on Charlotte's Flawless Filter in shade 3 as a primer. And applying that with a sponge. Because it gives me a bit of a glow when I'm feeling a bit... ugh. And yes, I'm in my pyjamas. I'm having a very lazy Saturday. But as soon as I get my face on... I'll get some clothes on. <laughs> Hello, Shoshana. Good, good afternoon, good morning, whatever applies where you are from. So, so I hope you... Um, do you know what? I can hear myself on echo now. I don't know if they, they're listening to my channel in the background or what, but I'm echoing. Um, what did you think? Oh, it's Lloyd. <laughs> Hello, Lloyd. Now, Lloyd is one of the boys that's playing the game in the background. Not playing, because we're both dead. So he's now watching me put my makeup on. <laughs> Do you find the Light Wonder Foundation very glowy? Yes, it is quite glowy, but I, I'm using, I like using magic. Because it's got vitamin C in hey, it, Lloyd. which helps with the pigmentation. And you know me, I quite like I like a higher coverage. But I have been using it a lot more recently. But this is what I did yesterday. So Magic Foundation. And I applied that with a beauty blender. I and... People were liking the glow, and I'm going to show you how I got the glow a bit more. Just checking I had everything in front of me. So I'm just patting that in. So I hope you ladies liked my first impression yesterday. I, I'm beginning to think that this palette might be the Marmite palette. Yeah, I, it's not my favourite for some reason. But I do come back to it, like you, Shoshana. You were standing still in a squad at the Um... But it's supposed to have stuff in that helps pigmentation. It's already remade the tower. But really? how stable the vitamin C is in it, who knows? But I think it's got other substances as well. So, right, so I did that. And then I did my magic away. My magic away. So I used seven for my face. I, Marmite, oh sorry, let me explain. So the mar, Marmite, there's a, there's a, I think you call it Vegemite in Australia and I'm not sure what you call it in America, but we've got something called Marmite here and uh, there's a big advertising campaign that says you either love it or hate it, which is true, that people either love Marmite or they hate it. And so when I say that this might be her Marmite palette, I think it's going to be a palette that people either love or hate. <laughs> you have both, yum. So, yeah, it's, it's, yeah. So that's why we call it the Marmite. That's why I call something the Marmite something because it's, it's one of those things. So I'm just looking at the feedback yesterday from some of the reviews. Some people really don't like this at all, this palette. And other people are like, wow, I've got to get it. So I think it might be her Marmite palette. But yeah, we had this big advertising campaign called You Either Love It or Hate It. And it was such a good phrase for about Marmite because it's so true. I love Marmite. It's so pretty wet. Should we add a salty next time? It is, isn't it? 
Now, when they go wet, I was watching because this was a, a some a comment by Really Re. She said, when they're wet, they're very like the eyes to mesmerise. And that enhanced shade of the first set, the day eyes, is very similar to uh, rose gold. Yesterday I used the Wonder Glow I actually hate and Light the Wonder together and my face looked like very oily. Yeah, it's a fine balance, isn't it, sometimes? Um, between between looking glowy and looking oily. So I'm just putting Magic Away Shade 6 under my eyes and I'm putting 7 on my face. Just where I need to correct things. I can't use Wonder Glow under, uh, under Light One. Do you know what? Wonder Glow is one of my least favourite products. I have it because I got it in a set a while ago. And I've got a few samples of it. But I wouldn't actually go out of my way to buy it. Well, I think it's a good match on my skin. Can you see? That's seven. It's a good match for my skin. I think the five was looking a bit pale under my eyes. And so I thought, I'll use six under my eyes. Um, so Wonder Glow, yeah, it just doesn't, I can't see it does does anything to my skin, but I think that might be because of my my skin tone. Let me just do around my nose where I've got those thread veins. So I did that. And then, you know, I always forget to bring something to the table. Always, don't I? Let me put some of that... Of course, I could always get the Jackster to get it for me. Wait, what? Um, Jack. No, don't worry, I'll get it. What, what, it what? take me to. You see that that pot of um, face powder there? It's got a brown top to it. Yeah, and is that a thick brush above it or no? No, leave that. I'll I'll sort the brush out. Thank you, darling. More banana. More banana. So that's what I did first. And then, before I set it all, I put on some contour wand in medium to dark. Around my face. Like so, and I do, used a setting brush, my setting brush. I use my setting brush to kind of, because it's really good for blending this in. And you think of it for powder, but it's actually really good for blending. Yeah, if you put it on before powder, obviously it sets it in place. And it... Yeah. It stops it looking too much like a contour. If you know what I mean, you just... So I was trying to put all my kind of liquids on first. Hi, my Ali. Hi, Ali, my Pally. <laughs> yes, good morning, Ali Pallies. That was Shoshana. You have basically found the phrase of the month. The Alley Pallies. I love it. Have to credit Shoshana with that. But I said to her, can I can I pinch it? Yeah, you definitely needed a name. My groupies. <laughs> I like being an Alley Pally. I like you being my Alley Pallies. Hey, and I've got more subs this morning. I always get more subs when I do Charlotte Tilbury first impressions. Gone up to 545 now. But I won't forget my Ali Pallies. Right, and then I put on some 
got the hair on the nose again. And then I put on some... Um... No? Yeah. Did I do yeah. that first? Make a new party and invite me. No, I'll do it in a minute. Why? I can't remember whether I put this on first. But let me just do my powder. Let me get a powder brush. That party or a party? So I just put on Charlotte's... Um, smelly powder um, in shade two yeah. you yeah. snagged me with ct products oh, i think that's how i found you right. charlotte snagged me with them as well oh, terry big time tap, 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 tap. Okay. i never used to have this amount of makeup I'd buy one or two items and that would be it. And then I found Charlotte Tilbury and I became an addict. I've always only used CT powders. I'm wondering if Shoshana, um, Shoshana well, I think RCMA is a good one. I'm just gonna get that. Um, very safe. Finishing powders. If you've got hyperpigmentation, there's one by Too Faced called Peach Finishing Powder. I must yeah, dig it out because I've got it somewhere and I haven't used it for a while. But it it will leave, it will finish your skin with a bit of a peach, very subtle peach undertone. Malachi. So I did that and then I did my... Let me just put a little bit more under my eyes. Why is the loose powder stinky? <laughs> I think it's it's the art. I think there's almond oil in it, and I don't think there is actually fragrance in it. But I don't think there's that, that much. Um, and therefore, I think that's what powder would smell like if it wasn't if perfume wasn't added to it, which is why I'm not that bothered by it. To me, it's like an earthy smell, and it's probably how powder should smell. Um, but some people really don't like it, which I respect. And then I just sprayed my skin to bring out the... Um, Charlotte's um, Genius Magic Powder is, is not matte. It's got a slight... Shimmer's the wrong word. I can't think of the word. Help me, ladies. You know what I mean? It's got slight kind of illuminosity to it. So when you spray this... Oh, I love the smell of this stuff. When you spray it, it yes, it brings out that dewiness. Thank you. <laughs> you find the words for me because these days I seem to keep forgetting things. Right, so that's what I did. And then... I finished finished that bit by doing some beauty light wand up here. But you know this is almost identical to mixing flawless filter and rose gold eyes to mesmerize if you haven't got the beauty light wand. And then I just dabbed this with my fingers. And then I dabbed a bit on the end of this ah. nose. <laughs> It's all right. It's only a highlighter. It's only going to highlight your nose. You'll just, you'll just look like everybody on Instagram, Jack. They all highlight their noses. Wet. What? Because I've just sprayed this. Do you want some face spray? It's only water, but it's got a lovely smell to it. Uh, no, no. <laughs> That's Jack Kryptonite. Jack's Kryptonite. Yeah. Hey, what makeup? Hi, hi, Jack. They're all saying hello to you now. Uh, do you want to play Close Encounters? Pardon? Do you want to play Close Encounters? Uh, so I just put some of that to highlight yeah. there and down the middle of my face and up here. So that's what I did before starting. Now, the icon palette. 
Do you want to choose my look today? Um, right, so tell me, what colours do you want me to... So we have day eye, day eye. The blue one. <laughs> Thank you, Thorndike. No, I did the blue one yesterday, darling. The gold um, one. But you want the gold. You want the gold. What, which gold? There's a few golds. Go on, you can pick one. Uh, how about this one? That one, you like that one? Yeah. Okay. Jack's picked that one. You can find any shotgun in this moment. Would Jack do your makeup? Yes, he's going to do my makeup one day. Aren't you, Jack? Yeah, but you didn't even do the video. No, I haven't done the video yet. A mix of gold. Okay, I, I do actually like that one that Jack's picked. Malachi, where do you want to go? Now, the thing is, I think you have to kind of... I, I think Charlotte, and somebody else was saying this, was it Shoshana? I think she's spot on. Malachi, you do the whole season. column. <laughs> okay, um, I'll try. Should we see if it works? I do think that Charlotte needs to be gone now with this prime enhanced and smoke. Are you telling me that these are lovely shimmer shades? I love them, but you, you, do you think this would work if I did? I don't really want to try it because I think it's going to look horrendous. Okay, but, you know, that as a prime, that as an enhance, and that as a smoke. Right. I, I it's not I smoke. No, wait, How can that be a smoke? Go, 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 I just... Mm. Oh, yeah, I'll do I'll do the date eye. I'll definitely do... All right, I'm going to do the date eye. I'm going to do what... I'm going to do what Thorndike said. I'm going to use first date. You know, at the start of the season... All right, I'm going to do first date. And I'm going to I'm gonna take the prime shade and I'm going to wet it. Yes. Right, I'm going to actually... But I don't like wetting palettes. So bear with me, because I don't like wetting palettes. I'm going to wet my hand and then put some on my hand, I think. Because I want to see if this does actually go in, like, eyes to mesmerise. So I'm just taking a bit of that gold... And I'm just putting it on my hand and then mixing it with the water to see if I can get it like an eyes to mesmerise. And if I can, then it's going to be a bit like bet. Malachi, you in? Yeah, I'm in. Hang on a minute. No, that's not going to work. I'm going to have to put it on with my hands and then, and then wet my fingers, I think. That's what I'll do. So this is the prime shade of your first date on Tinder with a very shy man who works in a library um, and has never been on a date before, but his mum has told him he's got to go on a date. And uh, you're going to turn up like this. So we'll, we'll invent a little story about how this date goes. So you can carry on the story, guys, as I'm applying the makeup. He's a librarian, right? He's a librarian and his mum has forced him to go on a date because she's fed up with him living at home. Um, and he's he's got glasses, he's very shy. And um, I'm... I'm who I am in my 20s, an opera singer, and I turn up with the date look. So you carry on the story. <laughs> How quickly does he run off? <laughs> and never be, yeah, he's never been kissed. I'm just, I'm just popping some water on top of this. He's never been kissed and he's sweating. <laughs> Oh, I love this idea. Carry on, ladies, because you're going to make me giggle. So I'm just actually, what I'm doing is I've put this on with my fingers and then I'm dabbing the water on top of it because I don't like wetting, I don't like wetting palettes. Oh. Jack, darling, 
Could you get me a tissue? It does, it, I don't think, I think we've run out of tissues on the table, but could you just get me a bit of toilet Malachi, roll? Malachi, stay here. My eyes are watering suddenly. It's because I'm giggling. You're all making me giggle. What do you mean, my friend Malachi? His heart's racing, poor chap, isn't he? Thank you. Oh, kitchen towel, that's far more respectable. Um... <laughs> Okay, go into the volcano. Go into the go to the top of the volcano. And then, why is Shoshana Mr. calling? Let's see. Okay, we'll His mother booked the restaurant table for him. him. <laughs> oh, I love it. If you go oh, don't. This is going to go everywhere. Right, now I'm going to use the enhanced shade. Actually, this might work. Let's go, Malachi. Because this actually isn't that shimmery. Don't worry, we're I went on an internet date. <laughs> I went on an internet date. This is obviously okay, before I met my partner. And. Well, I went on about, I think I went on about five before I gave up. I couldn't deal with it because I think internet dates are often for people that just are not very good at socialising elsewhere, and I am. So it kind of, anyway, I, it just, it turned me into what I wasn't, which was very nervous and shy about meeting someone for the first time because it just seemed so artificial. So I gave up, but I met this guy I turned up on the date and he, I think he really liked me, but he, he turned up and we were in this quite posh bar and he looked like he basically just stepped in some clothes that were sitting at the bottom of his bed for a week, like tracksuit bottoms. And Are you talking about me? No, 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 no. And then I asked him what his interests were and he said his special interest was um, 20th century... 20th century military oh, no, 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 history no, 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 from the world no, 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 world war one onwards and from there on in i thought get me out of here this way i know what i'm doing malachi it's just me and he, he said he thought we had a lot in common and i was sitting there going hmm. i'm trying to think what i was really trying hard to think what we had in common military history Oh, antiques, military history antiques from the First World War onwards. He turns up, oh, hang on, we've got some more of the story here. He turns up in thick bifocals, can't hardly see and tells you how beautiful you are. Does he tell me how subtle my eye makeup is as well, Linda? I'm going to put a bit more of that gold on. Now that that's dried off, I want I want him to see it through the bifocals. I did one year and year ago. He said he didn't drink because he likes to beat people up. And then a racial slur. <gasps> no. Not to use, use your pump unless it's me. I excused myself to the restroom and snuck out the restaurant. I used to have a code word. like So I, I'd always say excuse me, but I've got a friend checking up on me. So I'm going to ring, I've got to ring them at a certain time. And if I don't, they're going to come round, which I did. I had that. And I had a code sentence. So I had the friend waiting, like on standby. They would ring me at a certain time or I would ring them. And if I said, did you pick that toaster up in the sale? Did you manage to pick that toaster up in the sale? It actually meant, please come and get me. I need to get out of here and I don't want him to know. It's from years of working in mental health. We we did that kind of thing. Yeah, it just meant come and get me now. So it, but it sounded just so, you know. So I'd say, oh, just did you did you get to that cell? Did you manage to pick up the toast? And that meant come now, get me out of here. <laughs> now, the smoke shade. The smoke shade. Okay, well, I'll, I'll treat it like a smoke shade. This is the one Jack picked. 
So I'll put, tuck that in the corner. I might prove myself wrong here. So I'll tuck this in the corner. It's looking quite nice. It is, isn't it? It's looking quite sunset. Has the guy left the restaurant yet, or has he ordered the first course? I just need to that's okay, there we go. I'm not I'm on a hundred mats. Try and find a med kit in this building. And I'll smoke that under my eye with a bit of the the enhanced shade. Uh, med kit. No. He's dropped his cutlery. <laughs> I'm feeling quite sorry for for oh him right i'm first putting the enhanced shade underneath and my eyes are quite watery from the laughing so it's basically just you might i might as well have wet this because my my eyes are sopping wet underneath so that's the enhanced shade wet and then i shall put on the Smoke shade and mix that in with it. Don't use my impulses, don't do anything. And take it out. Okay, we're safe, we're safe. Oh, he does a runner out the gents' toilets. You look down into amazement, he's got odd shoes on. <laughs> Malachi, tell me if you find any men. If any guys are watching that wear glasses, I'm sorry. I'm not all guys that wear glasses work in libraries. I'm just being very stereotypical here. <clears throat> Never want to offend or exclude anybody in my humour. I used to, of course, what, what the other thing that put me off a little bit is doing the sort of internet date and obviously it's a blind date to all intents and purposes and i had this big dilemma about whether or not i should tell them about my disability or not before i met them so you know sometimes i did sometimes i didn't and some it, some people as soon as they found out they just they make their excuses and and stop contacting you that's if they hadn't met you before. And I just didn't like that. I just, to me, I'm comfortable in my skin about my disability. But I don't want that to be an issue, but it made it an issue because they hadn't seen me. Whereas if you meet somebody, he said he can't stay long as he's got to be in by nine. Oh, poor guy. And there's me in my, my gold ball gown and my... My iconic icon palette already. Hey, but hey, hang on. I, I just looked over. He's now left the bar at nine o'clock. But the barman's looking over at me with my date eyes. Carry on that story. Right, I'm just going to use some of the black to line my eyes. And again, I don't think I need to bother wetting this brush because my eyes are watering so much. Yeah, it could be a little bit like My Fair Lady, couldn't it? You know, actually, I take him to the opticians and anywhere put starts wearing contact lenses, and I turn him into Kevin Costner overnight. Or I could go off with the barman. What are we like? Okay, I'll try. Okay, I'm okay. Got it. in the circle. We're in the circle. He divides the bill. <laughs> don't knock it down, Malachi. No, no. Even better than that, he does. He divides the bill, and when the bar, when they come to to settle up, and we divide the pill, bill, he pays his half in luncheon vouchers. <laughs> Malachi, jump. It does work. Come over here. I take it Come all here. back. Where I am. But it does look intimidating, doesn't it? It right. just goes to show. Making a 
Vase. This is a shock. But all is not what it seems. Jock, Jock, come on down, down. Malachi, there are 14 other people. 349 in luncheon vouchers. I know that. I know that. And a guy just came up to us. You like her? Malachi, kill him, kill him, kill him. Let me just, um... He's in there, he's in there. That smoke shade... I'm just going to wet it and see what that looks like. Right. Malachi, get in there. In get for in a penny, there. in for a pound. Res me, res me, res me. Okay. Stop, stop. No, kill him, kill him. I'm just dabbing some Fix Plus over it and then I'll add a little bit more. Just on the lid. Make the crease bolder. That's the bad thing about being okay. in the circle, that people come to you if you're in this little circle. It's growing on you, is it? I think packaging and marketing can have a really massive effect on somebody's opinion. Like, if she'd put this in a two... Well, how many's in here? Three, six, nine, twelve. So she put it in three quads and called it something else and put it in her original packaging. It would have made a big difference to who bought it based on that. So I'm just going to build up. Look what replaced close encounters. High explosives. This enhanced shade. <clears throat> I wonder if we're gonna get C4. Oh, I'll see if Shishon's on that. Wait, have you ever played with Shishon? It's a great look when you're wearing pajamas. It really goes with pajamas and and a dressing gown. You don't like the casing. On Epic Games. What is it you don't like about it then, Linda? Just interested to know. I don't disagree let's with go, you. Let's go, let's go. What you mean the the front? This. Yeah. Too young and not classy. That's why exactly that's what I mean about it being marketed towards it's sort of but then again you see Charlotte might say Well I mean that reminds me a little bit of David Bowie. I don't know why, but you know that kind of 80s era so you could actually see it like that but i don't think you would but yes i agree with you that's why i said what i said yesterday yeah very bowie and she, yet she didn't mention bowie in that preamble to the palette she mentioned Malachi, kate moss go, and she mentioned um naomi campbell yeah, like somewhere you and yet she die did. Like you'd think if she wanted to promote makeup in men, she'd have said like icons of the past, like David you Bowie, die instantly, wouldn't you? We should join her marketing okay, team. I'm just going to put a few legendary brows in. Is that better? She had Ziggy on her. She like, I'll do a little pop of something. Okay. This yeah. prime shade of the diva eye. eye at the top here which is a bit lighter okay. so this one here thing, i'll just put a bit of that in the center of my lid just that to make sure that all, uh, that the date leaves completely and I, i'm alone with the barman there should be at least the maximum amount of chest there or three i think you could see that through bifocals yeah. that i look and then my other half's going to come in in a minute and I'll still be in my pyjamas with gold yeah, eye makeup on. But do you know what? You won't flinch towel. now. Steamed up by go. focus. Go, go there and get some well, I'll go to, I'll go to His mum's just watch. called to ask him how he is and whether he's safe. And he, he's... He's shaking in the bathroom saying he's scared, Mum. There's this lady and she's got these oh gosh, gold eye makeup on Malachi, and a boob tube. Like and, 
And she says, oh, you don't want a lady like that. Get out of there. I'll call you a cab. The Charlotte Tilbury stories. We should have a story for each look. Should we do that this week? Should we do some live get ready with me's and have a story for each look? I can't wait for the disco look story. Or the diva one. Right, this is my Mac Upward Lash, which is still going. They're still selling it, thankfully. Oh, by the way, Malachi, it's going on a bit clumpy because my eyes are watering, but normally it's very good at separating lashes and stuff. Do a tart look next. <laughs> I don't if think you build, I'm not sure whether that would sell very build, well, Linda. Build high because they can knock it down with the rockets. Oh yeah, I'm not turning up to the date in my dressing. Oh what you yeah, mean my don't. partner? Sorry, I thought you meant the librarian. Yeah, he'll think he's onto a good thing. I doubt it with a ten year old playing Fortnite in the in the in the, in the living room. Build a wall in front of you if someone tries to be wondering who I've had over. While he's been at work. <laughs> like, say if they're, like, right in front of you and they are about to shoot a rocket, put a wall... Especially as I just rang him and said, are you coming back in a minute because I'm about to do a live? Because he doesn't like being on camera. He doesn't like having photographs taken a lot either. He's very camera shy and I respect that. Definitely not the delivery guy. No, definitely not. He's got a temper on him. We don't want that. I got... Oh. Is where I wipe up joking, off joking. all my foundation on my nose. <laughs> Stockings or tights. Oh, you meant the librarian, not my other half. Uh, right, I'm going to put some pillow talk on. And a bit of film star bronze and glow. What lipstick do you want on? Do you want me to really drive the... um? The date away with Studio 64. Yeah, Malachi, get on, get on. There is another one, but I don't want to risk you getting split up from... So me you've got I very nude know. Studio 64 or Cantrape. You can uh, decide which one you want. The barman would like Studio 64. I think we'd better go with the barman. Do you know what? I'm, I was just... I opened the wrong thing by mistake. But there's no such thing as a mistake in makeup. If I can find it. But I'm just thinking what would look really nice with this. If we can find what would look really nice with this fine. look would be okay, a MAC blush, blush which is here somewhere. But I'm taking that out because that might look really nice. But there's something else oh, in here. Die. Just bear with me a second. Yeah. I know it's in here. I'm positive it's in here. It's just hiding from me. There you are. This blush called Style by MAC. I've got another one that's a bit shimmery. Let's see if I've got to see that one. Wait, Malachi, do you want to drive? It should be in here as well. No? Right, I'll have a look at your comments. Oh, oh stop watering, eyes. Stop yeah, yeah, yeah. watering. Quite a are faster anyway, I think. Let's go, let's go. Uh, Ooh. Right, Improper Copper by Mac. It's this is um cream color cream color base. Okay, make sure you don't crash into anything or die or drive into the lava. It's miles away, so like. 
Definitely wanting proper copper for the barman. And a bit of this MAC blush in style. I've got one that's really shimmery, but I think that might be too much. So, you know, there's enough going on with the eyes. You don't... When you've got some a bold look, you don't want to be bold Malachi everywhere, even for the barman. Awesome. Malachi, look where I am. Like, oh, what's happened to all my brushes? Them? Right. Um, so this is Mac style, Wait, which a is a kind of. I just thought this yeah, might go cannon. quite. Oops. This might go quite you nicely. Go. With quad this crusher. look, get get on the quad crusher if you want a cannon. Not blended that improper copper huh? in get very on well. So you want Studio I'm Sixty Four then? Who wants Studio Sixty Four? I better put some lip liner on first wait, wait, for that. Let's go for it. That's not that's not my lip liner. And he dribbles and says, Do you want to come back to miners? Me mum should be in bed now and he's only got to tuck her in. Linda, you're too funny. She is. No, no not that cannon. Not, not that cannon. You're all funny. You're all very good with the storytelling. I'm really glad that there we go. I suggested it. Malachi, this cannon, this cannon. Do you want to get in the cannon? Uh, right, this is Charlotte's lip get liner in, in Kiss and Tell. Don't shoot yourself. Don't shoot yourself. Now, because I've got a bit of foundation okay, on my I'm lips, gonna it's going to look pink, but it's not. It's red. Up. I'm going to aim you up. Aim yourself up. And it will just make... Because it's very emollient, that lipstick, it's going to make it last a bit longer, hopefully. Malachi, I went part of the line. Oh, my God. I, I miss some peeps. I miss some peeps. Oh, my Right here, I'm right here. Improper copper, I know. Kiss and tell, improper copper. It's all set in the scene for the story, isn't it? One day, do a tea with the Queen look and we will make... A oh, yes! That's such a great idea, Terry. We've started something. Unbeknown, we've... St tea with the Queen. I love it. Definitely. Let's do it next week. Should we have tea with the Queen on Wednesday? We're doing a story, Jack. This is called a date look. So I've said that I'm on a date with a librarian and he's very shy and his mum's waiting for him at home. We're having a giggle. You wear your hat. Very nice lip look, Jack. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's it. Well, Deborah, that wasn't a mistake, was it? You watch SML. Studio 64 going on just as you yeah, arrived. Yeah, I watch SML, Laser Beam, Sunday, 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 Because I know how much you like orangey reds. Yeah, I watched that. I watched that, it once. That one was good. I love watching I think the librarian has now had a heart attack. Oh, Mongol went live. Yes. And I'm giving him CPR. <laughs> but will the lipstick last? Well, well, Jeffy wasn't being bullied because... 
Because now all I've got to do is get dressed. And stop me eye watering. <laughs> yeah, it does look tame in comparison, doesn't it? Wednesday with the Queen. I'll buy a new dress and fascinator. Okay. Now, the thing is, do I put the title of Get Ready With Me and the Queen and everybody that hasn't been part of this live will... Oh, yeah, take my band off. Well, you want to Everyone ready, that hasn't yeah? been part of this live will wonder what on earth is going on. Shush my hair. You know when you go to Trini London and they make you up? I don't know if anyone's been. That's exactly what they do at the end. Is They, they get the hairspray out and they shush up your hair for the... The after look. The driftwood spawns everywhere. <clears throat> I think I need some uh, volumizing spray for this one. Look, I'll show you. One second. This is like back combing the hair. It just happened to be there. It makes it, it makes it stick up and give it loads and loads of volume. By the way, in case you want to know what this is, there you are. Label M Texturizing Volume Spray. There you are. So I better go and get changed out of my pyjamas now. Have a lovely day, everyone. <laughs> Ready for a night out in my... Well, the lipstick goes with my pyjamas. <laughs> All right, take care. Have a lovely day, everyone. And um, I'll see you for another look probably before Wednesday. But we'll have tea with the Queen on Wednesday. Okay. <laughs> And I'll have a look and see. I'll study the Queen's eyeshadows um, this week because I do love the Queen. Do, uh, does anyone watch? Has anyone watched um, The Crown on Netflix? Do you know how many times I've watched that? Because I just love 5, it. Times. About five thousand. About five. That honestly, I'm always watching it. I just can't stop watching it. When they take it off Netflix, I'm going to have to buy it because I just love it. I love. I love the Queen anyway, and um, I just. I'm not so keen on Charles, but I do love the Queen and royalty and stuff, yeah. Okay, so it's a, a series on Netflix called The Crown. Got to watch it because it's based on what happened and her becoming Queen at such a young age when her father died. It's absolutely fantastic series. You've got to watch it called The Crown. It's really good. And a lot of it, some of it is based, like some of it is poetic license but a lot of it is based on what really happened all right see you soon take care everyone have a lovely day and thank you for choosing my look <laughs>